Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Jemai Jets 333 and today I have an airport update for y'all. Um, I am currently battling a cold right now, so I probably sound a little sick right now, so sorry about that. But, And I'm also sorry that this airport update is 14 days, or actually 15 days late. I'm sorry, and I try to get these out as quick as possible, but the, um, I'm just getting a little too busy right now, and so I'll probably have the reviews of models that y'all have requested up at the beginning of the summer but sorry about the delay but right here we have a continental airlines operated by united in the peter max um livery sorry let's get that focused this is landing on fifth on runway 15 from maui behind the threshold we have a Southwest Airlines, California 1, 737-300, heading out to um, Pittsburgh. Behind that, we have an American, sorry about that, 738, uh, in the chrome livery, or colors. Um, this will be heading out to Chicago, here, or Case Elgato 17's airport. Um, I believe his channel has changed to Kevin Salgado, I'm not sure about that, but... Um, Right here we have a Delta Connections ERJ-175 taxiing to the gate right here um, from Houston IH. We have a United A319 um, heading out to Washington IAD. An Allegiant 757-200 heading out to Las Vegas, Nevada. An Aeroflot 777-300ER heading out to Moscow. An Asiana 767-300. I'm going to be pulling into gate A19. Um, from Seoul, South Korea via Anchorage. And then right here we have an American Airlines Fokker 100 heading, uh, it's taxing to its gate from, um, Tulsa. Right here we have a Spirit A319 heading out to Fort Lauderdale. A Southwest Airlines heading out to LAX. And an American Airlines 737-800 new colors heading out to um, Santa Cruz International Airport or Aviation Uncle Craig Uncle Gregor's Airport. Um, shout out to him. He has a really cool airport. He spots at DFW and um, he has some great spotting pictures. So I'll put a link to him in the description. Right here we have a Porter Key 400. Q400, sorry. Um, this will be heading out to Toronto, Billy Bishop. This one has some weight issues, so it has to be at an angle, so that's why it looks kind of weird after the turn. So let's get on with the internationals. Um, right here we have a JetBlue Airlines A320 in the bubbles tail. Um, this is deboarding from um, OCI, which is JetBlue 595's airport. This is a BCA route, not a BA route. Lufthansa, let me get to a better position. Lufthansa A380, um, boarding passengers for its flight to Frankfurt. And let's move this way. Erdo 767-200 um, heading out to Hoka Hokkaido International Airport via Anchorage so it has to make a fuel stop in Anchorage empty gate with the aging on is heading uh, taxiing towards TAP Portugal getting serviced um, bags being loaded up um, fuel and um, this will be heading out to Lisbon Virgin Australia, 777-300ER, um, heading out to Brisbane via LAX, empty gate. Philippines Airlines, A340-300, um, pushing back for Manila. British Airlines, 777-300ER, and the USA tail. Um, this will be heading out to London, Gatwick, after all the bags are... Uh, finish. Okay, so let's move on.
Air Canada, um, CRJ200, uh, this will be, Air Canada Jazz, sorry. This is getting the, the lavatory truck is behind it, and this will be heading out to Toronto Pearson. And then, let's, sorry, all the planes are at weird, weird angles today. Southwest Airlines, so there's an dash 800 Warrior 1, um, if it will focus, you can probably tell it's Warrior 1, but um, this will be attached to its gate from Las Vegas, Nevada. Allegiant A319, um, people boarding the bus. This arrived from Phoenix, Mesa. United Airlines 787-8 getting bags loaded on and catered. Um, this will be heading out to London Heathrow. And the United 747-400, I just pulled it into its gate from Hong Kong. United Q400, getting catered fuel bags um, for its flight to Buffalo. Buffalo, New York. Right here we have an Air Florida 737-200, um, just pulled it into its gate from Miami. And right here we have an Alaska Airlines 737-900 Disneyland 2 livery getting ser uh, serviced for its flight to SeaTac. The tail is really good. I love this aircraft. Very nice. Okay, right here we have an empty Southwest gate. Southwest Airlines 737-700 Illinois 1 heading out to Chicago Midway. Southwest Airlines 737-300. Heading out to Tampa. Bags being loaded on. Empty Southwest Gate, South Sun Country, 737-800. Um, this will be heading out to Minneapolis, St. Paul. US Airways, 757-200. Just pulled through its gate from um, Phoenix. Right here we have an American Airlines, 757-200. Pushing back for St. Martin. And right here we have a US Airways 767-200 um, pulled into its gate from Madrid. And then let's move on to the other side. Um, I just wanted to show you the shot real quickly. I think the shot looks really nice with the clouds in the background, and with the airport, and then the light poles really do make a difference. You know, if you can find them, I suggest getting them. And then adding service vehicles makes the airport look a lot more realistic. Just like my suggestion is don't get like three, get how many um how many gates you have, subtract that by four, and that should be the right amount because you could distribute them equally, like have you don't need every single one at each gate and then so I just like it and then all the um scheduled aircraft waiting to depart. It's just the airport looks pretty cool right now, I think. Okay, so right here we have Singapore Airlines 747-400 just pulled into its gate from Changi? I, I, I don't know. Changi, Singapore? I cannot pronounce it right, so I've tried several different ways and I still get comments saying I pronounce it wrong, so I'm trying. Antonov AN-225 um, this brought in Mm -hmm. Subways, uh, subway train cars for the um, New York Transit System (MTA). So this will be heading out to Ukraine shortly. And last but not least, we have Delta A330-200 heading out to Amsterdam. Passengers boarding on the rear, on the rear doors and the front door. So that's the airport update. I'm sorry, I sounded sick. Um, but. Um, let's just get the overview of the airport. Um, so, thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you, hopefully, next April. I mean, the bull, this, sorry, the end of this April. Okay, sorry for it being late. Bye.